Cancer, it's L here to do your June 2019 general reading. It is a general read, so it will not resonate with every Cancer who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Uh, thank you to those who already do so. Make sure you're commenting a yes or no question below. Okay. Because it may be selected <clears throat> every Friday. When I do my live read, I will answer questions for free. I'll select a few questions and answer them, okay? Must be yes or no. No long question. I'll just skip over that. So anyway, let's get into it. Um, so, Cancer. It looks like, for some of you, if this is a relationship, a relationship is at its end tail like you've had enough you've carried the relationship for a very long time um you thought that this would be a really good partnership but it is not there has been someone who has been unfaithful either it's you cancer or it's someone else there's someone who, who's made promises uh with no intention of actually acting out the promise uh, or holding to the promise. This could be a Sagittarius person, a Piscean person. It looks like the Cancer needs to be strong in their convictions and know that whatever it is you're trying to do, wherever it is you're trying to get in love and romance, you will land there. Um, you're going to have to be strong. You have a strength card. You have six of wands. This talks about being strong enough to walk away, to put work in on yourself. To, to really direct energy on yourself and look at what you've been doing in a cyclical pattern uh, and come out of that cycle, right? Um, it says that you put a lot of energy effort into maybe either being somebody's mistress or somebody off in the wind or off in the wings, someone in, in hiding. You also may have secret plans also, too. Um, and that is what you're wait, waiting to take action on. The universe says be final and definite in what it is you're trying to do. Judgment card here. Rest on on your inner wisdom and your, your intuition. How do you feel about this? What does your heart space tell you about this situation? It looks like something is over. We got the Ten of, ten of Wands. Looks like the Cancer or maybe the person the Cancer is dealing with has been carrying the load. Has been carrying the weight of the relationship, the burden. Um, the moon card governs the entire read. It says that a new project or some new direction is going to be is going to present itself as a challenge in your existing relationship and how you you act or how you react um, with this challenge or conflict coming up will be based on history, historic reference. What That cycle, that eight. What have you done in the past? Don't do it. Go to a new direction. That's what the Wheel of Fortune talks about. And here's your advice. Your advice, once again, is the Ten of Wands. You get the Ten of Wands twice. The Ten of Swords. You know that the, the, the Wheel of Fortune is, it governs the tens. It's about endings or the culmination of. Um... It looks like you need to end something because your luck is changing. Um, there might be a really successful relationship coming in for you, but you have to end one to have another. Keep in mind, you don't govern luck. Luck finds you. So you don't really govern the whole wheel of fortune. That's why it's uh, said to be destiny too. Um... You uh, also, um, 
there's a situation whatever this change is is happening it's beneficial to you we have the sun the will of fortune and we have two endings here two two, two rough endings not to say that this ending is going to be like a old cake walk and and you you're going to you know ride off into the sunset with no tears but it says once you release and allow like a complete ending not oh, okay we're done but in your heart of hearts you know that you're going to allow this person to come back next week no 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 when you allow a complete ending look what you get the sun and the will of fortune things start to move quickly for you the eight of wands sun will of fortune eight of wands only if you take the advice of the cards will you get that there may even be a home move happening here it looks like the cancer, either you or another person may have someone waiting in the wings. Or you have an idea of the person, maybe even the twin flame, soulmate type of situation that you want to go to or get to. Um, there is an opportunity for uh, a beneficial friendship or partnership that will lead you to a lot of happiness and success here with the sun card but you have to end something and then start anew let me tell you if you take the advice of the cards look what you get the knight of cups the seven of wands it says that you may either go to someone or someone comes to you with that emotional offer i want to be your your friend i want to be your girlfriend boyfriend they're going to be very persistent this is either you or the other person because they feel as if they are without you you are wish fulfillment keep in mind our nines are are about separation so you're not with this person they may be the nine of pentacles they pay you no attention right now they're being abundant independent in their own life in their own life and it um is very attractive to you so much so that you want look that new start ace of cups ace of wands you've ended one particular situation and now you want to start anew this could be a cancer who is in a very authoritative position you be the a man or, or masculine energy with all these tens here this may be my cancer man and then my Cancer Man card comes up, the King of Wands. Yes, this is a fire sign. But every time I do a reading, and it is about a Cancer Man, this is how the Cancer Man shows up in the reading. So this may be about a Cancer Man, could be a Cancer Woman, because we do have the Queen the queen of Cups here. Um, the Cancer Man knowing who and what they desire this affirmation the, the the affirmation the king of wands is i want or i desire uh so there may be a cancer man who is um definitely desiring a new start and wanting to have that but needing to end The Will of Fortune talks about a new direction, too. So this is a cancer who wants to go in a completely new direction. With someone they are not with, they are in separation with, someone who they look they look at as, as um, emotional fulfillment, the, the perfect partner. They want to renew love or start new. You want to grow this relationship by way of passion and desire if you feel like this reading resonated with you cancer i'm not going to do any um extended reads uh just for the sake of time 
but you can always request um, the three card spread. It's five dollars and fifty five cents for the month of May. In June, it will go up to six dollars and sixty six cents. Um, yeah, it looks really good. If and this could be in career and finance too, Cancer. There's something very promising that can come in for you if you allow a complete ending. If you know that you're on the brink of an ending in career and finance, then this is what it is. Also, this can talk about fame. Some of you, your name out there, you, you're worried about your reputation, uh, what, what it is to leave a situation and go to another uh, yeah, some of my cancer men are committed. Of the higher, the higher fan, the King of Wands, King of Wands, wow, the Two of Cups, King of Pentacles, the Judgment, the Star card. Uh, some of you feel as if the right path or, or renewal of a, of a relationship. Some of you want to renew something with someone who you are in separation with. Judgment again. It's coming back around. Are you renewing this? This is definitely a man in authority. This is also the cancer uh Wondering if this relationship with a big corporation, institution, some organization is um, is mutually beneficial. That's why some of you are choosing to separate or, or cut or sever ties with and propel yourself forward and do self-promotion. Or well, the cancer has been, you know promoting something or someone else the cancer is in the spotlight you wonder if this yeah you might have to go out on your own cancer get that three card reading it's five dollars and fifty five cents um it'll get give you some clarity it's an inexpensive read. I hope that um, this reading gave you a bit of clarity. There's something or, or someone you're trying to get to. This is definitely um, a situation where you have to be. It looks like the cancer is pretty much done with. Lots of tens. No nines. Not really except for... If you take the advice of the cards, you're trying to get to somebody or something. It's also maybe a business venture that the cancer has. If they separate from one big institution, then the cancer looks like they're going off on their own. If they're separating from a marriage, then the cancer is trying to uh, go off on their own but also very much in love with something someone else okay all links are below cancer um i hope the reading resonates with you for you take care know that i'm praying for you pray for me as well bye